I have two sisters who are lawyers in Washington state. And when I first heard about this, I said, you got to be kidding me. I remember how intense it was for them, but it was hard, but it made them better. Isn't that the way it's supposed to be? At least I think they did. They're awesome now. They're fantastic lawyers. So how crazy is that, that people can skip the bar exam? But it turns out there's actually quite a bit of thought that went into the decision, and a lot of smart people think it is going to make for better lawyers. So let's dig in. Starting in May of next year, a program called the Supervised Practice Portfolio Examination, that's a mouthful, will be given in Oregon. Law school graduates who choose to go that route will be able to practice in Oregon without taking the bar exam. Instead, they'll have to prove themselves by actually doing the job that they studied for. Requirements include 675 hours of practice under the supervision of a licensed Oregon attorney. It's a little over four months of eight hours a day, five days a week. That number was not plucked out of the sky, by the way. That's understood to be the general amount of time that someone would spend studying for the bar exam. Next, they'll have to submit a portfolio of their work. It'll be made up of eight different projects. Each one of those has to be delivered to a board of bar examiners who will give it a thumbs up or thumbs down. Do you see the problem with this, um, um, guys? Anybody in the chat, too? Do you, do, you, do you see the inherent problem with this? Well, I mean, here in Cook County, it doesn't matter because you you don't need a lawyer anymore, a criminal lawyer, because... <laughs> The, pub, the state's attorney's office is not prosecuting. So you don't even need a lawyer. Who cares? So what's going to happen is they're doing this, Oregon's doing this woke because people of color pass the bar exam at a lower rate, right? And to make it fair for all people, they're going to get rid of the bar exam, right? This portfolio submitting eight projects being graded and assessed by whoever, right? Who you think is going to have the lowest rated portfolios? Uh, Juice Crew. <laughs> Who you think is going to you know what I'm saying? So, like, anything you have where you have to be tested or has to be judged or it has to meet some requirement, the people that do worse on the test are probably going to do worse than that. So it's like you can't fix these things, man. Because now it's going to be like, well, we see and we're noticing that that – uh. There's inherent bias in the people who are judging their portfolios. So now the people who are judging the portfolios are going to be slandered as being racist. I mean, this would all go away if they would just admit the reality that DNA dictate, dictates much of these outcomes. And we'd all be better for it. It's that simple. Yeah, yeah I think so. And you, and you know what? I, I think they should. Uh... Just had these lawyers do a five uh, paragraph essay on why some people are victims of the system. And fuck it, you're a lawyer now. We could all be lawyers. <laughs> yeah, everybody's a lawyer. Fuck it. If everybody's a lawyer, no one's a lawyer. It's true. We and all judges. Kings. We're all judges too. Right. And we was all kings. Somehow. Somehow. He's guilty. Stand. Just he's guilty. Just look at him. Look at his face. He's guilty. Right, right. If he's a gladder, he's guilty. Yeah, this is this is this is not gonna work the way they think it's gonna work. They thinking that they're gonna have like, I guess it's gonna be more equitable, it's gonna be more diversity in the pool of lawyers that's coming out of here. And what's gonna happen is, man, it's gonna be a lot of people that's gonna be called racist now. Because the test could you would you just call in the test racist or um, what is it? What's the thing they say? Um, bias, culturally biased, or whatever. Yeah. That's one thing. Now you have people. You do your six hundred seventy-five hours under the, like a journeyman under some lawyer, right? What if that lawyer is white, and he says, "Hey, man, you're not doing a good job." You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, right. Hey, look, let's let's be honest. Like that lawyer shit is very fucking hard. 
all that case law they had to fucking go over and that recite. It's a lot of shit, man. Yeah. And, and man, trust me, I get it, man. I'm sympathetic to people who don't take, who don't test well. I am. But you're not going to fix it with this, man. Um, 